hello guys welcome back to good show tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix an error which is regarding linking the phone number with your modern warfare 2022 beta and how we can fix this error so many of the users across the globe they're getting this message when they are trying to launch the game beta they get a message like this mobile phone number required a mobile now phone number must be linked to your steam account to play modern warfare 2 This requirement help us to reduce disruptive behavior and ensure a positive community experience for all the players. So please add a mobile phone using the link below which you can go over here or else you have to go to the Steam account and you having these option. So many of the users is no don't know how they can fix this app. So what do you have to just have to do? follow the instruction on the Steam because you have to add the phone number on the Steam. Many of the users might not be added the phone number on the Steam or they have been verified. So they that's why they having the issue. So if you wanted to fix this you don't have to worry all you have to do is just have to go back to the steam so this is your steam account okay this is the home page and this is how it looks like so first thing what you have to do is you just have to go at the top over here in the top left corner there is an option called steam you have to click on this particular icon then you just have to go to settings you have to click on settings now from here as you can see you have to click on view account details now from here you just have to scroll down and what do you have to do is you just have to scroll down and over here over here like this you'll be getting an option like this as you can see on the contact info i have already added my email address and it is verified so my next thing is which i have to set is all about i have to add the phone number as you can see i have been added my phone number here right so that's for a security reasons or for their uh, kind of things for the steam they need this we don't know what is actually this has to do with the modern fire war uh, modern warfare 2 so i have to click on add phone number so once i added the phone number i'm getting the option like this right so uh, add an sms capable phone to steam account so that they will they need to verify so we have to give the number so uh, here i have to type so i am from india you can select the respective country like this so here i am from india so i have to give my number that is 7293776161 So once I done with this one I have to go for next. So what I have this as you can see first we need to confirm that you are really you please check your email and click the link we sent you before continue, uh, continuing this. So I have to go for the next. So it's like uh, it is getting some message like this so I have to sign in back to the my account. So I am here in the middle of the video. So guys now over here I have already signed in. Now I got a message like this so I have to click on add phone number. So right now it's it is showing to me that it is confirmed the email id is confirmed so i just have to go back to the steam then i just have to go for next so right now they are sending to me that an sms code right now i receive an sms code on my phone i have verified my email all you have to just have to open the email and go to the steam and you have to verify it right now they send me an a, uh, a code so i have to give the code over here so i'll be giving that that is 676358 Okay, so I'll go for next. Right now, as you can see, it is successfully done. So I have the added my uh, details over here. So I'm very uh, good on this. I mean, I have done successfully added this. So next one is all about if you wanted to change, you can do the same. We can manage phone number. So I'll go back to the uh, Steam. Uh, I'll go back to the store itself. And once it is done, I'll close this. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll close this and I'll open Steam once again. Right. So this is how it looks like. Now what I'll do is I'll go back to the game, out to the library, and I'll try to launch the game. And most probably the issue will be completely fixed. And this is what you have to do. And I hope this video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.